Hi guys, my name is Emeka, MC Nerotreka. Today I will teach you guys how to connect sumo pump, the process and what to do, the procedures. So watch out. So guys, watch, watch out. Black to black, blue to blue, lead to lead. Lead to lead, blue to blue, and black, black to black. This is the output. This one, this one go directly, direct to sumo, direct to the pump. Is the output. So, this is the, this is the output. This is the output here. Let me connect the input. So this is the input. The input wire. I'll connect it here. See the input wire, so I'll connect the two of them here. So this is the two uh, the input, and this is the output, and this is the art. So so this is the Otahita switch for the control. For the control switch, this is what I hit his switch. So here, I have, this is the input. This is the input from here. This is the output from here now. I connect it to input of the sumo control. So immediately you off this one. On it, or it controls the the small boss this this one now this one here control the small boss this one control the small boss you can control it through the through the small switch or you can, can control it through here so this is the source the power source this is the one that bring light from the cutout fuse to the water heater switch from the cutout fuse here the water heater switch so this is the input this is the input the one that bring direct from the generator to the cutout fuse from the cutout fuse to water heater switch from the water heater switch direct to small bus do you see the connection from the water heater switch here from this water heater switch here from the output from the output in the water heater switch to the input of the bus of the small bus so that once you off it once you off here here will totally off once you on here here we on you can you can control it from the off and on here but here is the general control 
this one is like something it's like it's something like fuse when excess current flow on it the cutout fuse will cut this is just the circuit breaker that is just like circuit breaker this is the control switch of everything here so once excess current pass through it it will it will break so here i have the fuse here this is the fuse here so here now here is here is the connection here is the connection this one now this this light this led now i connect it this led now i connect it from direct from the fuse here to here and pick this one now neutral neutral now pick the neutral from here to here so immediately if, if there is excess current this wire this fuse here this fuse here will cut it, if there is excess current it will cut here we cut it will cut so here now I've done the connection here I've, I've done the connection this is the one that bring light this is the one that bring light here from here now come down to this place so this one now this one is the output this one is the output this one is the uh, output a single fuse this one is the output this one is the output so this one connect control this one is the control once SS current pass through it it will cut so so I'm copying this the cut out fuse this one is acting like this one is acting as fuse so this one is the what I hit a switch to control this to control this sumo control so it's more switch to control it so you can control it through here you can control it through here so let me couple let me couple it now So this is the this is the process. Everything is set now. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel. Thank you for everything. Please like, share and subscribe. Turn on turn on your notification button so you instantly get all the videos I'll be I'll, I'll be posting every day, every day. Thanks.